How is it going everybody? You're watching Then About Tech and Apple has finally released iOS 26, which I'm currently already running right here on my iPhone and it's just amazing, incredible. But I decided to make this video just to answer some of the most important and relevant questions at the moment. So first, what are the actual compatible devices? Which iPhones can actually run iOS 26. And on top of that, let's talk about dates, the release dates for the betas and of course for the final official version. So without further ado, let's talk about one of the greatest updates to iOS ever. Let's begin. Starting with the compatibility list. Will your iPhone be able to run iOS 26? So if you have an iPhone 11 or newer, the answer is yes, including the iPhone SE 2 and SE3. So if you have an iPhone XR or XS, you won't be able to update to iOS 26. And I'm mentioning those two devices specifically because they were able to update before that. In iOS 18, they did get updates to the latest version, but now they won't. Apple dropped support and compatibility for those two devices, and it's completely understandable. They're getting too old and iOS just wouldn't run very smoothly on those devices. So just to make it very clear, the iPhone 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, and 16 series, the entire series, and also the SE2 and SE3. And it's very interesting because even though the SE2 is really old, but it uses the same processor as the iPhone 11. So that's why it's compatible with iOS 26. And the 10s, for example, which is way more expensive, just isn't. Now let's talk about availability and release dates. And you have to understand that there are actually three different versions of iOS 26. And it's always been like that. Same with iOS 18, 17, and so on. So version number one is the developer beta, which is this guy right here which is this version that I'm running right now on my iPhone. And as a matter of fact, if you wanna run iOS 26 right now on your iPhone, of course, it has to be compatible, right? And if you wanna do it completely free and official, that's the official Apple method, I do recommend that I take a look at this card right here, link in the description, because there is already a video on the channel where I teach you step-by-step -step how to run iOS 26 right now. Of course, this is a beta version, this is a test version, but you can if you want to, all right? So that's version number one. Version number two is called a public beta. So it's still a beta, it's still a test version, but it's more refined, it's better, it has less bugs because it's a beta version made for the public, that's why the name. So the beta public will actually be available next month. So in July, if you want to be more precise, the 14th of July, you'll be able to run the public beta on your iPhone. And of course, the most important of all, the final version, the official version. So iOS 26 will be available to everyone in its final form in September. So three months for now, three whole months, okay? Uh, more specifically, if you want to go there, uh, a week after Apple releases the iPhone 17. So one week after the iPhone 17 event. So if you wanna know the day, it's gonna be on September the 15th. So pretty much exactly three months from now from the recording of this video. And really, that's all that I wanted to tell you today in this video, just the compatibility list, all the dates and availability because I know a lot of us have this question, so I just decided to make this video to tell you, just like that, what you actually wanna know. So, thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe to the channel because there are a ton of content on this amazing WWDC week that I'm sure you don't want to miss. So we have a ton of tutorials, videos like that, review, analysis, go ahead, go ahead and subscribe to the channel and I'll see you on our next video. Bye-bye.